activity even as we go into tomorrow. That's uh, what to watch out for if it comes through. 70s and 80s, also some low 90s. But again, holding uh, with this kind of pattern now as we go into tomorrow uh, with the clouds as well. 75 in Irvine, Hollywood, 78. Panic Marina, 91 degrees. It's 407. One health department in Southern California confirms that there's been double the number of cases of an ailment associated with unclean pets. It's not a disease we hear much about in typhus, but it's on the rise in the city of Long Beach. It seems to be sort of throughout the city, if not a geographical connection there. Um, we think it could be because a lot more people are home during the day, so maybe they're telecommuting on, they're actually around their pets and around their home more rather than in an office. So typhus is a flea-borne disease, and a lot of times, you know, the person might not even notice.
and unsafe sleepers before Congress took action. We'll talk with Consumer Reports in just a couple minutes. Kelly County Public Health Director talks to KNX about why she thinks vaccinated people should mask up again. These stories next 15 minutes right now. More 15 with the traffic every 10 minutes on the 5. Steve Fox. We've got a problem on the 405, and this is a motorcycle crash. Well, the tipster just called in to confirm it. 405 uh, on the northbound side, right of Venice. The two left lanes are tied up with this wreck. Uh, so heads up, we've had a number of crashes on the 405 in the Culver City area. So uh, I predict it's going to be a slow drive this afternoon with these wrecks. Then on the 605 northbound in Whittier, just past Beverly Boulevard, uh, new wreck reported uh, right shoulder of the roadway, so cleared out already. West LA, uh, trouble and slow traffic. 10 eastbound, this is just past Overland. Uh, we've got a truck and a car in a wreck, and this happened out in the left lane. Uh, traffic is backed up almost into Santa Monica now on that eastbound side of the 10. We're going to head back to Brian to have an update on that problem in Linwood, 105 Jam Camp. Looks like a little improvement here. We have uh, two lane lanes blocked, East 105 for Long Beach Boulevard.
lead your feet to the fire to make sure these products are safe for infants and children, correct? Exactly. Now manufacturers will, will you know, if this law goes through, manufacturers would not be able to sell uh, incline sleepers or crib bumpers, uh, and any sleep product would have to adhere to a safety standard that is, is in place for cribs, bassinets or cradles, play yards, or bedside sleepers. Those products are safe for babies to use. Those have been vetted, those have been safety tested. Uh, so manufacturers wouldn't be able to sell a product unless it adhered to one of those standards. Property value 